The Teacher software is an essential component to customizing your Augmented Arc system. The Augmented Arc Teacher software gives the instructor complete control to set up and modify the training program. In addition, instructors can manage and monitor student activity and progress from a personal computer. Installation. To download the teacher software, see your owner's manual for the computer requirements and the website link. Login. Once you have installed the teacher software on your computer, connect the computer to the Augmented Arc Network. Next, open the teacher software on a computer. The IP address login screen will appear. For classroom configurations, the IP address is always 10.0.0.1. To obtain the IP address for standalone configurations, log in as administrator on Augmented Arc. Press the button for system settings to view the Ethernet IP address. Enter the IP address on the teacher login screen and click Connect. The user password login screen appears. Enter the username teacher and the password augmented arc and click the login button. Course organization. Here's how the teacher software is organized. A course is composed of one or more modules. Each module is composed of the required units. The tasks, which are the theory, exercises and quizzes are included in the units. Each course can have a list of students assigned to it. Students. Let's start by adding a few students. Click Add Student and the student data screen is displayed. The name and password fields are mandatory, but the remaining fields are optional. Modules. Now we'll add a module. Starting in the module screen, the left side displays existing modules. Recall that a module consists of units, each of which consists of tasks. Let's add a new module. Select Add Module. Enter the name of the module. All other parameters are optional. Select Accept. In the left panel, select the name of the module you just created. Select the Tasks tab and select Add Task. Select the type of task you want to add. Let's create an exercise. Since this module does not contain any units yet, we'll add it to a new unit. Enter the unit name and then submit. Proceed to enter the parameters for the exercise. Required parameters are marked with an asterisk and all others are optional. Select Next to proceed to the next screen. Select the desired parameters and repeat the process until all exercise parameters are entered. The system guides you step by step through the intuitive process. Leaving a parameter undefined will allow the student to select it on the simulator. Now let's add another task to this unit. Select Add Task. In this case, let's create a theory task. To include this task in the existing unit, select the name of the existing unit. Select Submit. Enter the parameters and then select the PDF document to be uploaded. Select Accept. A window lets you know the file is being converted and uploaded. Depending on the size of the file, this may take several minutes. A similar process can be followed to create a quiz. To change the order of the tasks, select a task and then use the up-down arrows to move it. Creating a course. In the course screen, the left panel displays existing courses. To add a new course, select Add Course. Proceed to enter the parameters for the course. The course name is required, but all other parameters are optional. Select Next. To add a student to the course, select the student in the student's list. Then select the right arrow to move the student into the course. Repeat for the remaining students to be added to the course. Select Next. To add a module to the course, select a module in the modules list. Then select the right arrow to move the module into the course. Repeat for the remaining modules to be added to the course. Select Accept. Now, when a student logs into the simulator, they will have access to the course content that you have assigned to them. Virtual Classroom. The Virtual Classroom section of the teacher software 
shows the teacher what's happening in the augmented art classroom in real time, including a pass-fail score for each student. Select a course and then click on the student's name to view detailed information about their exercise. Reviewing student activity. After a student completes a task, the teacher software lets you review the results. In the Students section, select a course and a student to review the course history. After selecting an attempt, select Review Attempt to review the detailed scores and graphs. You can also replay the simulation video and generate reports. For additional information on setting up your Augmented Arc welding training system, see your owner's manual or visit MillerWelds.com.